going on, folks? Welcome back to a another episode. Millie, hey, leave the cock alone. No, no, bad dog. Quit chasing the cock. Oh, God, did he make it in? Oh, thank God. Woo, we about had a... It, oh, God, Lucy, Lucy, Lucy. Oh, God, Millie, where are you going? Millie, why does she like the cock so much? This poor rooster. He's just minding his own business. Where are you going? Why are you so wound up right now? Ralphie! Hi, Carol, how you doing? Hey. What up, big girl? You like you like your hay guy? You been munching on that hay? What are you doing, buddy? How's that little ass of yours? How's that little ass of yours, bud? What's she doing back here? Hey, little assy. Oh, you're so fluffy. Hi, buddy. How are you guys? Carlos! Everybody misses you, Carlos. Look how fluffy he is. He looks pregnant. Does he not just look? <laughs> he does. He look does. Carlos, you got a bun in the oven, buddy. How you doing, sheep? So you pigs are actually like pigs? mildly quiet today, surprisingly. Like, I feel like they're not quite as loud as they are usually. What's going on there, Luce? Go get him. Go get him, Lucy. I don't know where she's going. She anyway, I don't know. Anyway, Ralphie, <laughs> come here, buddy. Banjo's got Ralphie's new brush. Llama, I'll brush you, Llama. She don't like being brushed. Ralphie, Ralph. you want to get you want to get brushed, Ralph? Oh God, yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, Ralph's all about that brush life. Look at that. Yeah. Look at that. Good job, Ralph. You're killing it, my guy. <laughs> Ralphie, what do you think about Millie? Lucy, what do you think about Ralphie? Banjo, I say you just climb aboard. Give, give, give him the old ride. Nah, how you doing today. there? How you doing there, I buddy? Need a helmet first. Oh, you need a lot more than that, Ralphie. These lips. I don't know you, if I like You like, like them. those lips? I don't know. Ralphie, what are you doing there, they buddy? Give me weird feelings. You guys want some grain? Oh, hey, buddy. Yeah, they do. How are you? You hanging in there, guy? Oh, banjo's brushing. Look, oh, he's happy. He's a happy, humpy camel. 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 A happy, humpy camel. Anyways, we're gonna give these guys some grain, get them fed for the day before we get on with today's adventures. Jerry! What up, buddy? How's them nuts doing, Jerry? Eddie! What up, Eddie? Hey, how's it going? How you doing? Let's go ahead and give these guys some grain. Hey, Ralphie! Oh, God. Hey! Hey! Ralphie! No! This is cheating, Ralphie! You can't! Ralphie! Hey! Get out of the feed bucket! <laughs> so Ralphie! Big. You're gonna break the fence, my guy! Hey! Hey! Listen, Junior! Listen! Hey! I'll get you your own, just relax. There you go, come on, come on. There you go, here you go. Hey, right here. There you go. We're double fisting right now, boys. There you go. Spread out. That way the animals don't have to fight. Lucy, who are you trying to get right now, buddy? No, you leave Chungus alone. What's Chungus up to? Big boy! What are you doing in there, Junior? Hey, no, you come back here, Chungus. He's going back in his hut. He's going back in his house. Chungus! What up, buddy? You want some grain? All right, I'll give you some grain. Don't worry. Chungus, right here, my guy. Bony apple feet, son. Chungus loves his new home. He's always just booing in here. And it's, it's Millie and Lucy proof, which is, means a lot. If they can't get in, then I would say most predators probably can't get in. Maybe a raccoon. Raccoons are kind of sneaky little guys, but I don't think a coyote or nothing can get in, so... Well, Chungus has food. Yep, he's got water. He's hanging out. There you go. Get some of that grain. Hey, no, go back in there, Chung. Chung okay. He don't know what he wants right now, but we're hanging out today, making sure the animals are fed, taken care of. I gotta go hang out with my boy Ralph. What are you barking at? You guys missed him. He just barked. Yeah, right. He's pooping. You want to is he? Yeah. Hey, I, I I burp when I fart too, or something. Oh God. Hey, easy. Easy. I'm gonna break it in half. Hey, it's a big nugget, Ralphie. Ralphie. Listen, guys. He's a big boy. All right, you want the whole nuggy? I don't know if I can break it. Oh, there we go. Hey, you gotta sit. You sit. You sit right now. You sit down. There you go. He sat. He sat. He sat good enough for me. Man, your breath stank, my guy. God dang, son. You like that? These are a little alfalfa pellets for Ralphie. A lot of the animals here, like the sheep, I don't think the, any of the male goats can have alfalfa. It's, it'll make them bloat. You gotta sit. Can you sit? We're still working on that right now. God dang, look at that. Banjo, how's that brushing going? He likes it. Let me, let me, get, let me give him a rub. Hi, big boy. What's Dude, he crunching look his, on? Look at his eyelashes, though. It's to keep the dust out in the Sahara Desert, because that's where we're at. And we do have a lot of dust from the gravel. I love Ralph. Hey, how's the weather up there, guy? You guys hear that? Is this... Camel ASMR. I say Banjo needs to climb aboard. Yeehaw. Give him the old ride. I'll do it. I think we need a saddle. We should probably research it. Like, it won't hurt their back if you don't have a saddle. You're the one that's rode camels before. I'm not. I was on a saddle, yeah. You're the camel expert. But I don't know if you, I don't know if you have to have a I feel saddle. Like you don't have to, but. You don't like I don't so? know. You probably should, like, research where, like, Dude, you sit here to sit. If you had a pick. Sit here. You can make this a total afro. Look how thick this fur is. Look right here. <laughs> what is he doing? He sniffed me. I didn't like <laughs> hey, it. It scared me. Hey, boy. You want, you want another Scooby snack? I got a Ralphie snack. Oh, hey, wow. hey, hey. Hey, hey, you want Scooby? Oh, he wants Scooby. Ralphie, follow me, Ralph. Let's see how well trained he is. Look at this. I got this guy trained. Come on, Ralphie. Come on, come on, come on. Hey, 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 come here. 
You want a Scooby snack? Come on, come on. Come on. Look, he don't even have to turn his body. Look at this. <laughs> Look at this. Ruffy. <laughs> now put it as high as you can. Ruffy, hey, up top. High five. No. Look up there. Hey, you want a Scooby? It's as high as I can go. Oh, no. <laughs> hey. Oh, you <laughs> gave me a kiss. kiss yeah. Hey, there you go, guy. That's a good Ralphie. He's so content. He loves his Scooby snack. Llama! You want a Scooby snack? Hey, Ralph! <laughs> hey, it's okay. Hey, we can share. We have lots of snacks. No, Ralph. Listen, guy. That's a brush. This is the Scooby. We gotta get you to sit. No, don't eat the brush. Look, he, he thinks you've got a Scooby snack too. Dude, we definitely gotta climb aboard this guy. Dude, I'm telling you, we get a pick. You get 100% make this into like a huge fluffy afro. I don't know how many of you guys thought you needed that in your life, but you definitely needed that. Good job, Ralphie. You're doing good. You just gotta give him some Scooby snacks. He's gonna be, he's a good camel. Huh, buddy? You hanging out? That's it. Two. Two a day keeps the doctor away, all right, guy? Nux. All right, I'll see you later. I'm leaving, buddy. All right, I'm on the other side. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Carol, Carol, don't do anything I what You crying? Carol, why are you so sad, Carol? Why you got tears running down your, would, would you stop that? Quick, quick, that. Carol, what's wrong, buddy? Hey, everybody misses you, guy. What are you doing? Hey. What's, he, what's this thing doing right now? Hey, what are you doing, Ralphie? Ralphie, you be good. We are headed to the farm, though, folks. Everything is fed, taken care of. We are going to run down. Banjo got a new pew he wants to uh, get sighted in. And so we're going to run down there. We're not really sure what the rest of the day has in store. It's a beautiful day out here. Hey, you keep it up. You just wait for Thanksgiving, Ed. All right? Pipe down just a little bit. Jerry, you tell him. Jerry, say hey. Ed? Thanksgiving's coming up, you better be careful. Like I said, we are going to go down to the farm, get banjos, peace sign. We're not really sure what else we're going to do. We're just going to kind of run around, spend the day, um, just kind of looking around stuff. Obviously, we got deer coming up and all that jazz. So, with that being said, we'll see you guys down at the farm. Shoo! All right, folks, well, we made it down to the farm. We're going to check out banjos, Pew. And then I talked to my buddy Trapper Jay. He said he's down here. He's setting, well, he's, he's looking at traps, setting traps, doing trapping things down the road a little bit. So, we're going to go meet up with him later and see kind of what he's got going on but banjo's new toy he wanted all the ladies to see it sure he's strapped so what what is this thing called by the way thank thanks for the wind again appreciate it what do we got here it's an akv akv what does v stand for that means it's nine mil i don't know v is nine sounds sounds about like geometry class yeah right? that makes a lot of sense yeah so it's nine mil yeah so it's like a hand pew yeah so you but it's not a hand pew it's an arm strap nobody uses it as that but okay. that's what makes it technically legal got it so technically legal and with uh, what with, uh, with what regard what do you mean it has to be a brace so you have to be able to it can't be like just shoulder it can't be just like a normal shoulder mount because it's nine millimeter so the, huh? this yeah i know the brace Wait, makes what? it legal because it's nine millimeter so you can't have you can't have an ar that shoots a nine millimeter. correct they, without this brace some weird so, law so what do you mean without the brace what's it look like without the brace you can't have it the brace this brace the arm brace that you like nobody puts it on like that okay but that's what makes it legal because they can't they said you can't just mount it so I it has know. to have this yeah but so, nobody so, so if you cut that off you're on a jail you can't sell it like that i mean i don't know what they're gonna do but really that makes sense, yeah. yeah no but, it's the dumbest law ever just because it's a nine mil though yeah so, it, it needs a velcro strap otherwise yeah, so you can like be like you know, that's safe. That's those. safe. Well, yeah. I like that. That's safe. Yeah. Can't so you can't just have a normal shoulder mount to so nine mil. Strap do. It allows you to not use it just as a shoulder mount. It allows you to do it like that. I don't know. Really? There maybe be people in the comments Should that be like, yeah, this is so thing. dumb. Yeah, you guys have to let us. No, I've never heard of that in my. I've never heard of that in my life. I talked to a police officer about it. A cop, a cop told Banjo. He told him he has to be strapped. If you're not strapped, you're out. Have you shot it yet? Yeah. Oh, like, you have really. Like one mag. Oh, really? I didn't sight it much. What kind of what kind of scope you got on that? So what, that looks kind of like, uh, try, I'm trying to channel my inner cod here. I don't know what that one looks like. You kind of cut that off, you're almost talking UMP45. Kind of like an MP5, because it looks like an AK. It looks like a little yes. AK. Well, there was there was one AK47U. The U, you know, that's, that's probably about as close to that son of a gun as it is. I like these mags, can you tell how many is in there? Oh, yeah, you can actually see them. You got them double, all double stacked. Oh yeah, 35. Jeez, Christ. Right. So that's our target. Here's our target. We're going to give it the old... <laughs> See what happens. All right, Rick. Let me see. How's this thing work? Ready? Really? You want to go in there? I don't think so. I, I saw three so actually. Either. Three on burst. Yeah, yeah that's you got fine. it. Yeah. That's legal. Yeah, that's what this thing's for. Yeah, you got it. Hey. Yeah. Oh, rip! That 
one right through my leg too. I feel like we're really close though. I know. We, I don't know who set it up so close. Well, I was. You got tired I of took. Walking, I took it out of my truck and then. You got tired of walking the base over there. You think we gotta worry about ricochets from here? It's angled down a little bit. I, I feel like I need glasses. I feel I'm like scared. I need. I need a shield. I need a riot shield. I can see it's hitting the dirt. Yeah, I mean it's angled down. But so. it could hit the dirt and come back. It too. could also hit that. I like how that base is angled out of this too. I feel like at any point I'm gonna get it hit. Yeah, at any point I'm gonna I'm get scared. hit. Yeah, I'm gonna I, I'm gonna get you back. I gotta I gotta get back. I don't feel comfortable here. A is auto, right? Yep. Wait, what does A actually mean? Auto? Try it. I don't know. I haven't tried it. Yeah, I have my finger's still on it, so. So A is not auto. Let's see what F means. F is not auto either, banjo. Let it rip. Kick it to slow mo. How'd that look? Is that neat? I guess. That's we'll pretty have to neat. see you later. Alright, full jet. It's yours. Full jet! Going oh. hot! On the last oh, door. Yeah, oh! Wait, how'd you what do was that? that? He's got the cod trigger finger. What was that move? How'd you, wait, how'd he do that? So it's a sensitive trigger. Clearly! And <laughs> it's standard. I haven't changed anything on this gun. And he kind of bump fired. It was not intentional. Wait! What? Wait! How'd you do that? I don't know. Are we allowed to show this? Can I show that? I mean, we didn't do anything illegal. No. Yeah, it's not that illegal he's just a beast. God, Okay, the cod trigger weird. finger. Dude, just you playing. literally ripped off like four or five rounds. Like, that was sick. Banjo <laughs> got some unique gun here, I guess. He didn't do it. No. How did he do that? <laughs> I don't know. That was, ne that was neat. That was neat. You I got like another it. one? Yeah, I got one. I got another one. All right, I got it. I got to try to figure this out. I think it just does it. Dude, I don't know how to do it again. It's been going on F. Yeah, I didn't know if that looked weird. No, when I pulled it, like it's almost so like normally it's squeeze, shoot, squeeze, shoot. This was like you barely touched it, so it's yeah. like. Yeah. I think you got like two or three rounds off. I'd put like a disclaimer out there, like don't try this at home. Yeah, don't. Yeah, oh, this video is totally getting off, taken off YouTube now. <laughs> we didn't even mean to do that either. One more try here. like a three round burst. What is going on? <laughs> I don't know what you bought, Dude, but I want one. I I didn't change anything. I literally just put this on there and I put an optic on it. I haven't done anything to this guy. <laughs> I didn't know this was a thing. I don't know if we can show this. This is nuts, dude. That was wild. That was... You had like three consecutive yeah. bursts. Oh my gosh. Get this away from me before I hurt somebody. Right, oh my god. Up. Yeah, he got it. This thing's scary. I don't know if I like Dad, this. I don't know how much we can show of that. Well, folks, there's your uh, shooting segment for the day. Don't know uh, how YouTube's going to like this one or not. I had a good time. I don't know about you guys. But we're going to go try to meet up with Trapper J, see what he's got going on. He said he's got some beavers, some raccoon straps. So we figured we'd show you guys that because who doesn't love a good old fat furry beaver? Shoo! So we made it over to Trapper J's place here. Ooh. Hey. This is where you do your live streams? Well, You're probably nose blind to this stuff, huh? Look at all this. I said we set that guy Check out there. Out. I'm gonna pause on that thing. That's Wait, a link. A li what? Yeah. Wait, where'd you get that? It was sent to me. Really? In a Martin. 
Oh my People god. Dude, this is good. Dude, we gotta get the, we have to get a scrap mount. <laughs> look at that guy. <laughs> we, gotta, uh, we gotta get the old scrap. Oh, he's judging me. He's cuter than hell, look at that guy. So this is what you got today? Last two days. Beaver, big muskrats, beaver. raccoons. Dude, that's a fatty. That's, that's, a big that's big boy. Goodness. Oh, and there's a coyote there. I didn't even see the coyote. He's just hanging He's out. He's smaller than the beaver. Yeah, he really is. He was caught in the drowner. Really? <laughs> Dude, this is crazy. Wow, this is this is crazy. Yeah, I see. We're gonna have to go check. It. We'll go look at the beaver dam after this and see see what's out there. If we got any more beaver dams, but figured you guys would enjoy seeing this. Get look, get look forward to this trapping season. It's coming up hot. That's how you do it. You see those? Yeah, there's three ducks there. Hey, I told you there would be ducks. Here. Look at these guys right here. Now you guys can't see nothing. Wow, we just pulled them. I told Dan it's a bando. There might be some ducks. Why is my seat reclining? You're pushing Ooh, it with what, your leg. What are you doing there, buddy? Are you hitting it with your leg? Your truck knows. Hey, it's time to relax, guy. Okay? Oh, there's another one. That was a mallard. Oh, there's Don't two. There's two. Drive up there. Hang on, boys. <laughs> oh, there's more. There's oh, more. Oh, dude, it's oh. loaded. It's loaded. It's freaking loaded. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, there's so many ducks. There's so many ducks. There's so many ducks. They're pissed that I'm driving. Oh my gosh. You gotta be you gotta be kidding me right now. Alrighty folks, well now you guys can't see those. Maybe, yeah, maybe. Yeah, they're probably not. There's like 30 ducks. Banjo, why aren't we hunting here? This is crazy. We're going we literally just came here to check out this beaver dam. I, there's quite a bit of water though. You can see a lot more than usual. Look at these ducks. They're right there in the sun. You see them right in the sun? They're blinded by the wow. light. Well, let's go. Um, we're gonna go investigate. Maybe we're gonna go duck hunt this then. If that's the case. I mean, that's yeah, 30, 30, 40. I, it looks like mallards and some like smaller ones too. I don't know if they're teal or, or what they are, but well, we're gonna go check out the beaver dam. You saw Trapper Jay, he's been trapping beaver, so he's he told us he would come help us if we wanted some help trapping these guys. This field has not gotten flooded. But look at all this wasted space. That could all be delicious corn. The reason why it's not is because it has the potential to flood, gets wet. So Kyle and Andy are not able to actually plant this, which means this is costing them money. Apparently it's good for the ducks, but and same thing on the, the other side. There's a lot of uh, wasted space there. This, this should all be corn right here. It's not just because <sighs> the beavers got the water sitting up high. So I'd say... We need it. We need to strategize. Though, okay, this is the plan. You guys ready for this plan? Here's the plan. We don't have one, but what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a shovel and a trail camera. I want to get a head count. I why there's a nine mil in my pocket? I'm not quite oh, sure. Oh, you're ready. I don't know why. I thought one fell in your pocket, but I thought it was just a casing. That's no, hole. it fell in my pocket, and it, uh, it was a whole one. Did you rack one? Yeah, and it, when it yeah. wasn't. And it, and it landed. It might have. That's, yeah. that's pretty impressive. That's so here's the strat. We talked. We were talking Travel Jay, trying to figure this out. So he thinks caster mount sets which are not how we've normally trapped beavers here is you cut a big hole in the dam and then you put uh what do you call them their body grips three thirties yeah three thirties and they swim through and it traps them those are not the most efficient he said that caster mounts the most efficient which is basically you build up a mound of dirt you get beaver caster which is like what they mark their territory with you slap it on there and then you put just a normal foothold and they just put their paw on or whatever the flipper whatever they whatever they got dangling down there and they step on it so we want to get a head count though we want to figure out how many there are so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a shovel bust the dam up just a little bit just just a just one of them guys put a trail camera on it cell cam so i get pictures sent to me so i can be like okay trap j there's you know there's one here there's two here whatever might so we're, we're gonna get a head count just so we know what we're dangling with if we have a whole family multiple families just one big badass beaver whatever it might be we're gonna get the trail cameras on it hooked up cell cams and that way i get pictures sent to me and i can review them with you so let's grab the camera banjo's like got the shovel and let's go destroy a little portion of this beaver dam. But I'm honestly thinking, before we destroy it, we gotta duck hunt this thing first. I'm down. I say we duck hunt at least once. That's good. Maybe twice. Eh, maybe three times. And then kill the beavers, then blow this thing up. Or get the excavator in here and dig it out with the excavator. That might also be an option. So that's the plan. See you guys there. Well, 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 Banjo, what do we have here? Ooh, we got another one here. What's this guy looking like? Yeah, I see. That's the old sli slippery slide, slippery slot, slippery slide. Oh, okay, okay. okay. English is pretty tough. What they do? Look, they go this way, and they run out to the cornfield, and you get yourself some corn, and they come back like that, or they go that way. So what you do? You could. This is a 330 spot, though. Yeah, it's pretty deep. We right could. Here. So look we could. That. We could bring a 330 and put it right here. Yeah. So what that does when they swim into it, traps them. So we could probably put a 330 here at least, maybe another spot. That's pretty deep. I'm down for a 330. I love a good 330. Just kachows them. So you can see what it looks like, though. There's one tree right here. So flooded. Yeah, this was not like where that tree is. It should be land. On the other side of that tree is the creek. Like this is not supposed to be water right here. Like all this. There's. And we got trailer right here. So oh god. Dude, they, they dammed it all the way up. 
Even last year, it was only like to here. They dammed all this up back here. Yeah, so I'd look, say there's more than one. Look at this. And then they run this way. They're so easy to predict. They're the smartest things ever, and they're gonna kick our ass. But man, they're definitely back. Last year, we didn't do we didn't do nothing. Oh my god, look at this. We did not look how deep that is. So you could put a 330 here too. Wow, dude, there's definitely more than one. There has to be. Look at this. This is not supposed to be water. Like this is supposed to be 100 field dry. They built this. You can see where it's starting to leak over. They just keep building up. I mean, it's like the fact that they've dammed this up is just absolutely insane. Like all those trees, they cut all those down too. Those weren't cut down before. I'll have to go look. I'm gonna go look at the actual dam itself. Wow. Well, I think we've got some really. Uh, they say we get Trapper J out here for a day or two. 330s, Caster Mountain. We're gonna have beaver for dinner for many dinners. Look at this guy. This runs down to the lower pond there. It was freshly cut. Really? Like today, like that was definitely today, yeah. Dude. Look at that thing. They're just munching on that for no reason. They eat the tree or no? Yeah, they, they do eat. I've heard they've like, they eat the bark and stuff a little yeah. bit. But I think they like that corn out there too. Look at this. Like this is a whole, this is, this is in itself is a dam. Wait till it's you guys are mud. new. Okay, we've been d battling these beavers for three years. This is our third season. This is just crazy. All this is all dammed up. It's not, it's literally just supposed to be a nice shallow creek. Are they making their dam out of bugs? Yeah, they just. Or is, or is it only wood? No, it's mud. Yeah. Really? So they use like sticks to stop the flow, and then uh, they pack mud on the sticks. Really? Why oh yeah. So smart? They, they can build better than we can. That's what I'm saying. Why do you have an AK? Just in case anything acts up. All right. So then, like, look at this. They said, screw it, let's just put the whole tree right here. Like, they're, they're preparing for a freaking war, folks. Look at that. That little Ricky. This is a really good spot to trap raccoons, too. Because think about it, this is the only way to really get across. From this field to that field, they have to run. I bet you get deer and all sorts of crap on this. Like, this grass is new. Yeah. This grass, this is like grown, because it's been here so long. So, I'm afraid to walk. Now, I remember what this is made out of. It's just lo Trees. very loose sticks, yeah. You can fall and break your ankle here. I'm looking at these tracks. There's deer, there's raccoon. That's bobcat or coyote. Right here, there's all three, right in this area. There's another one. It might be bobcat, or it's a really small coyote. One of the two. But there's your creek, see here? It's, it's tiny, like that's how this is supposed to be. It's just a little, little stream. Look at this. Oh, we could definitely duck hunt this sucker. I don't know where we'd go, but it looks good. So the ducks were laying here. I bet this is pretty deep right here. I mean, you can see the water is almost down though. See how it's it's been up at least a couple more inches above this. And their house, their house is over here still. I don't think they've, they've probably not moved their house much. First year we found it. We actually trapped one on the house right next to it. But, oh yeah, look at that house right there. That's fresh. They have, they have fresh, fresh uh, like sticks and grass and stuff on it. Right there. So there's our house. You can't really, oh, you can trap by their house, but you can't like blow it up. But the dam that we've blown up is this. And it's all grassed over. Like you can see it. So it's running somewhere over here. So they've got a, they've got a leaky, leaky. Yeah. Yeah, they got a leak. Rip. Wow. Did not I did not expect this. I mean, I knew the beavers would probably be back, but this is like, this is next level stuff. So we're gonna go ahead, we already have a T-post out because we've done trapping here before, like last year and the year before. So we're gonna go ahead and let's see if we can, uh, you say do what? I thought the beavers put the T-post there. Extra structure, I, dude, I would not put it, it past them. Yeah, they if they're just like, up. hell yeah, this thing's out of metal. Look at these deer, you can shoot a deer off this sucker too. Really? Everything walks this, like, gimmick. I guarantee if you threw some traps, you'd catch raccoons, coyotes, you don't wanna catch a deer necessarily, but wow, interesting. So go ahead and walk. We're just gonna leave the T-post there because we're lazy. It doesn't really matter where we break it. We're gonna try to put a dent Put a dent in the dam. These have really good, like a lot of zoom. So we want to make sure that, yeah, let's see if we're gonna, is there any way to straighten that T-post or? No, come on, you got it. Interesting. He, he did it, not wow, me, all right? He did it, me. not me. Pull it out. I got it. There you go. Oh, there you go. That's the old muddy T-post there, guy. Well, let's dig your trench right where you put that. Okay. So give, her, give her a kick, swift kick. Yeah, uh, you got it. Come on, you got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. All right, how's that look? Oh, we got some flow. Oh, God, yeah. That'll piss them off. All right, beavers. This is your final warning. Oh, there you go. This look is your that. final warning. Oh, they're about to be ticked. Look at that. Oh, they're not going to be happy with us. You don't want to drain it too much because we do want to go duck hunting, but there's plenty of water. How wouldn't be? There's no way this will drain overnight too much to where we can't go duck hunting. We might duck hunt tomorrow morning. It wouldn't be a bad idea. I saw a lot of, lot of birds out here. So we're going to go ahead and clean this off a little bit. Camera's going to get set up over there, pointed this way. And we'll check in with you tomorrow after they've maybe fixed it, maybe not. See what happens. You guys stay tuned. Millie. What are you doing, buddy? Hey guys, how's it going? Time to review the footage of the beavers. Why there's dogs up here, I don't know. This thing sucks also. Here, put that on, tell me what you think. Would you rather wear that or drown? I don't know if this would save me from drowning. I, I feel I, like it would just... I think I'd rather drown, honestly. Yeah, it's uncomfortable. Lucy, what do you think about these beavers? All right, so here we go. Time to review the footage. Why there's dogs up here, I don't know. Why are we in a boat? Why we're in a boat? I don't know. All right, what camera is my beavers on? 
Millie, are you out of your mind? Hey. Why would you do that? Uh, she turned the trolling she motor turned on? She turned the trolling motor on. That scared me. Millie, don't do that. I thought someone was shooting. <laughs> It sounded like rapid fire. Dude, I thought we were, we got ambushed. Oh, Millie, why, why would you step on the trolling motor paddle? Oh. Dude, that's so why we don't have night singing. so loud. Millie, get down. Where are you going? Oh my god, oh, alright. I thought she found Banjo's gun. <sighs> Dude. Oh, there's like six guns in this back deck. Oh, I thought yeah. we were, I thought she was just letting one eat. Alright, A3, filter. We're gonna start back to where you can see me. Alright, so as you can see right here, that's a picture of me. I'm standing there. Getting the shot, making sure we're getting the angles ready. So scroll up here. Nothing. Let me let me let me go to this view here. Okay, we're scrolling. I don't know what it's triggering on. I mean, there is flowing water. I'm not seeing much. Oh, beaver right there. Oh Dude, that's big chunky too. Look at him. He's like all the way out of the water. There's yeah. one. So he brought that little. Looks like he brought that little branch. Yep. Look at him. Big boy. Yeah, he's a big boy. Oh, there he is again. Yep. So this is at 8:03. Yeah, look at that. You can see him pretty Dang. good there. 8:03. He's there rebuilding. Look at that, he brought that tree. That tree was not there. No. The one on the right, and then you see him swimming. So far I've only seen one though, look at him. He's just cruising. So, I mean, one is not bad. I feel like we can handle, we could handle one beaver. I'm just seeing if there's more than one. So you can see he's put all that, like yeah. I wonder, so it's nine. So he's wow. been doing this for an hour. Keep scrolling, we still see him at 10. Not much going on there, but you can see how much brush he's built up. Look at, wait, so he was carrying that one. He's, cause watch, gone. Yep. And then look, he was carrying that whole branch. Oh, crap. That's him. He's carrying the whole tree right there. Goodness. He's bringing it all the way down. And that's it. Oh, look at that. We got ducks. Some wood ducks? Oh, there's some little oh, look at nice. those. Is this can we scout with this? Is that I mean I mean, I don't, I don't see why not. You see this? We got wood ducks on there. Those nice ducks. So just say, hey, the wood ducks showed up at eight ten. Let's, Let's go, go shoot. Them. Melee. <laughs> what are you Why well, she looks so proper? what's up there? Why'd you get the troll motor? Why are you in a boat? Why are you so large? Alright, anyway, so it looks like he was building it. I see, I mean, there's movement. I'm trying to see if I see, okay, so 3 a.m. So that was seven hours. He was going he's gotta it. be exhausted, but there's only one. I've only seen one. He might've taken a break though. I mean, 2.30, I see him, no one. Now he pretty much worked you through think all. think they just take shifts and you just see different ones? Maybe, maybe they, he's like the scout. I feel like there's no way there's just one beaver. No, not, that dam's way too big. So it, it, was, it was such a small blowout that they just sent like the rookie and was just like, you'll fix it. I'm not yeah. going out there. I'm sleeping. It's the middle of the night. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm guessing that's what they said. Yeah. All right. Well, that's what we've got, folks. One beaver. We're going to go out there. If you guys want to see us trap this beaver, we're also going to go duck hunting. Uh, we got to do that. Go duck hunting out there. We got to trap the beaver, blow up the beaver dam. And if that doesn't work, take an excavator out there and dig the entire beaver. We're done. We're ending the series. This is what? Season three? Yeah. Season three, beefcakes versus beaver. Okay. This is when the se this is when it all ends. This is the last season. Season finale. Coming in hot. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. We'll catch you guys in the next one. And Peace.